Hey y'all, it's Betsy with Happily Ever After, etc. And welcome back to another cruise video. It is so blue and sunny here. It almost looks like the Caribbean, but today we are in Olympia, Greece. So, if you've watched any of the videos from this cruise, you know that we are exhausted. We did Athens, Santorini the last two days. We are tired. We are uh, done walking for the minute. This cruise has seven port days in a row. So today we are taking it easy. We're gonna get off the ship and do the hop on, hop off bus. Not doing any hopping off, just hopping on. We're gonna do the full circuit, see what there is to see here, and then we'll come back to the ship. So from the ship, it looks like there's quite a long pier, and then at the very end of the port is where the hop on, hop off bus is, so that should be pretty easy. We're gonna go ahead, head that way, and uh, see what there is in Olympia, because I really don't even know uh, what what Olympia Greece is known for. Keep thinking it's something to do with all of the Greek gods, but we're not finding a lot of information. So let's see if we can figure it out. The water is so blue. There are a couple other ships here today, but you can see when you get off the ship right down here at the front of the boat, the long pier will have to walk down and then there is the hop on hop off bus and the parking lot of the port. So that is where we're headed. All right, so once you get off the ship, looks like you have to come through this little gate and then start the long walk down the pier towards the hop on hop off bus. Don't worry, there is a duty free shop right here if you need a duty free souvenir. There we go. All the way down. We'll see you there. All right, we finally made it. Should we hop on, hop off? It says it is five stops. 10 euros a person. All right, y'all. So once we got on the hop on hop off bus, there were only three or four stops worth any uh, getting off. The main one was in the town of Catacolone. So first you go through this little port town that you can walk to, and then it's about 20, 25 minutes into the actual town. Since we were here on a Sunday, the port town was open, but most of the actual town was actually closed up tighter than a drum. All the doors had closed signs on them. Um, but it was a really nice ride for 10 euros. It was actually really fun getting to see a little bit of the countryside here as opposed to just the bigger cities um, and go through the little farms and the little areas where people actually lived. Then getting to the town, we, we did see a lot of people out for like a brunch or a morning coffee with their families. And then we were back into the port town. So this was a pretty simple day. You can go from Catacolone where the ship ports into actual Olympia. It is about 45 minutes to see the ruins. So it just depends on if that's what you wanna do. But we're gonna let you just enjoy a bit of the countryside here. And then we will get off and go through the port town uh, once we are back, back to Catacolone.
All right, we got off the bus. And we're gonna walk back through town, see what kind of trouble we can get oh, into. Mama. It's got me, mom, and we've uh, we've acquired we've Tyler. acquired Tyler for Hi. the day. So let's go see what we can do. Mom already found a giant duck. You gonna bring him back to the cabin, Mom? All right, let's go. I took a bunch of pictures. You're good. Alright, you can see the hop on hop off bus, so we're going to head back to the ship. I hope you guys enjoyed this little relaxing tour of Catacolone. I know we didn't do anything exciting, but with seven port days in a row, sometimes you just have to do the simple thing. And so today we just kind of wanted to see the city, see the town, and get back on the ship. So we will see y'all tomorrow uh, or next week if you're watching the YouTube series when we go to Capri, Italy. Bye y'all.